Hey everyone, welcome back to One Cent Sports Cards YouTube channel. Today, I am opening up the 2020 Topps Brooklyn Collection. This is a set that is offered exclusively to 582 Montgomery Club members. This is actually the first thing that was offered to the 2021 membership. It is a 2020 set, but this is actually not a complete set. This is actually just a pack. It is not a cheap pack, but it comes packaged beautifully in this gold, almost like cigar box type, um, type, uh, you know, uh, form factor. And it will have two autographs in here, probably some parallels. They are beautiful cards. And the Brooklyn collection offers some very big autographs um, within the baseball history. So there's Hall of Famers, there's current superstars. The autograph checklist is loaded. Again, these were offered exclusively to 582 Montgomery Club members. And we will break this open to see what we can find inside. Now, normally I would just rip this right over the top like that. We're not going to do that for this set. I'm going to be a little bit more delicate, try and keep the box in good condition because I do like the boxes. It's not often that you get boxes that are this nice from a baseball card product. Um, and let's see, do we get, do we get some of the odds on here? We do. So the approximate odds of, let me see if I can get that on there for you. Get that nice. There we go. Beautiful. So base card parallels, we can have black, one of two, gold, one of three, blue, one of three, orange, one of five, purple, one of seven. We've got red, platinum, autograph parallels are purple, one of eight, red, and platinum, one of 71. So platinum is one out of 107. So very low production run on these cards. The platinum are the one of ones. So we'll see what we can get. Reds would be one of fives. I'm assuming purples are one of 25, et cetera, et cetera. So we'll see what we get out of this. I did only order one box and we will see what is inside. So this is what it looks like on the inside. And you'll notice there are, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six cards in this pack. So we will open this up, just a beautiful box. This one, unfortunately, this one came a little bit ripped and damaged here. They must have had a little bit of trouble getting these in, but still a very cool, very cool box here. So we'll keep this out here in the back. We'll see how we can hide these cards while we do the reveal. So let's see this one. How do we want to do this? I'm going to go like this. And then we will open it this way and keep that on the back. Then what we'll do is we'll pull our foam and pull this top one back out. So let's do a reveal on the first card in this set. Now the back two will probably be our parallels. So we'll see what we get there. But our first card is going to be a Shohei Otani, beautiful design here. Let's take a look at the back of the card. So over its 80 year history, Topps has created and reviewed thousands of trading cards and packaging designs. Some go down in history and some just miss the cut. In recent years, Topps uncovered a file that includes vintage card designs from the 60s and 70s. This unique set displays the content from this exclusive vault, paying homage to the design teams of Topps past so this is a 60s and 70s design this is screams the 70s so we get a Shohei Otani as our first card in this in this pack our next card is going to be a very nice hall of famer Duke Snyder I actually have a Duke Snyder bat sitting here in the card lab with me but a very nice Duke Snyder here Obviously, a Dodger legend. So we'll put Duke over here. See what else we get. We get a nice Nico Horner rookie card. Nico Horner from the Cubs. A very good, um, very good uh, rookie for them. 
kind of had an underwhelming season in 2021, but I do believe he's going to rise a little bit. Probably a good prospect to keep an eye on, but a beautiful looking card right there for Nico Horner. So we score a rookie. And then our next card is going to be, oh, look at that. A beautiful black Juan Soto numbered 10 out of 75. So a Juan Soto black parallel. A beautiful card there. Nice hit for sure. So a Juan Soto parallel comes out as card number four. So it looks like we get a black, which black was, we'll go back and look at our odds here. Black was actually one of two. So that's the most common one you can get. Our next one going to be a Garrett Cole blue. And this one will be numbered to 40. 39 out of 40, a nice Garrett Cole there. I believe blue was one out of three. So let's take a look there. So a blue, yeah, blue is numbered to one out of three. So we get our second parallel. It is a blue, it is a Garrett Cole. So a nice Garrett Cole there. And that will be our fifth card. Now, remember how I said there was gonna be six cards in this set? I could have swore there's seven. Now there's a re there actually is seven, and there's a reason why. The next card here isn't as thick as the rest of them. So here's why. Let's see what this redemption is going to be. <laughs> oh boy. This you are due to receive an autograph gold parallel of Luis Robert from the 2020 Brooklyn collection. Now let's see gold. So that is an autograph Luis Robert gold. Gold is for an autograph parallel. It doesn't even mention it on here. It says autograph parallels, purple, red, and platinum. There isn't gold even mentioned. However, gold is mentioned on the base card parallels as a one of three. So I would assume that this is going to be somewhere in, maybe it's the base. I don't think it is, but we will see. I don't think it's going to be. However, a gold autograph parallel, Luis Robert. Any Luis Robert is going to be worth a lot. So that is a monster, monster hit right there. I will have to look this up on eBay and I will post on the video in post editing how much this card is going for on eBay. However, I believe this would be a card that is worth well into the three digits. Um, and I'm going to have to find out what it's actually going to be numbered to. So with that, that is a huge, huge pull. And we are not done because there is one more card coming. So let's see who we get out of this. It will be our last card. A Mike Soroka numbered 57 out of 75. So we get a Mike Soroka base autograph numbered 57 out of 75. And this is a little bit of a different design here. A certified autographed card from the 2020 Tops Brooklyn collection. So a nice one here, 57 out of 55. Soroka, unfortunately, in the 2020 season went down with an injury, um, but is one of the Braves' best pitchers, was gonna be their ace in 2020. So a very nice Soroka here, a young star for the Braves. Obviously, you would like to get a hitting prospect, but if you're not going to get one, um, Soroka, not a bad one to hit. I'm trying to find a top loader that'll fit this one kind of a little bit tighter than that last. This one's going to work good right here. And that, you guys, is the Brooklyn Collection. We hit a monster, an absolute monster in the Luis Robert Autograph Gold Parallel, another redemption on the One Cent Sports Cards channel. So you guys, 
If you like this video, throw over to first, hit that like button for me. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit that bell because we do all sorts of breaks on this channel. Um, we do all sorts of different uh, set reviews to give you all the information you need to know about the sets that you should and should not be buying into and what you can expect when you're getting into breaks and all that yourself. Uh, all sorts of different fun videos and unboxings like this. There is a Patreon group. There's a link in it below. If you would like to join that, it is a great member. It is a large uh, community member um, on, on Patreon with a Discord group attached to it that is very active. It's a great group of people in that group. Be sure to check that out. And until next time, guys, I hope you're having good luck on your personal pack polls and pulling things like a gold parallel Luis Robert um, autograph. That's awesome. So I hope you guys are having good luck on your personal pack polls. I hope that you are being good to your family, being good to your friends and to your neighbors. And until next time, Enjoy the hobby.